Are there any other recordings that we should be concerned of? Uh, I don't know of any recordings that you should be re, uh, concerned with because I don't do things wrong. I do things right. I'm a legitimate person. I'm not like Biden that gets hundreds of millions of dollars from people and countries and says, uh, we won't give a billion dollars, but you got to get rid of the prosecutor. And then guys like you don't do anything about it because nothing happens. Now, we do things right, so I don't care about any recordings. And I said it very clearly. I had a whole desk full of lots of papers and mostly newspaper articles, copies of magazines, copies of different plans, copies of stories having to do with many, many subjects. And what was said was absolutely fine and very, very perfectly. We did nothing wrong. This is a whole hoax. This is just like the Russia, Russia, Russia deal. This is like the fake dossier. The dossier was a fake. It's all been a big fake. Ukraine, Ukraine, Ukraine. We went through these things ad nauseum, and this is seven years of this stuff, and now this one. And the one who's done it wrong is Biden. He has 850 boxes all over the place. Nobody even knows where they are. He's got many boxes in Chinatown, D.C. What are they doing there? And he's accepting money from China. He's got boxes all over the place. I'm covered by the Presidential Records Act. I'm covered also by the Clinton Sox case. It's a very important case. It's law. And we did absolutely nothing wrong. This is just another hoax. It's called, uh, I would say, election interference more than anything else. It's a disgrace that they can do it. Next question. But everything was fine. We did nothing wrong, and everybody knows it. You're not concerned, then, with your own voice on those, on those recordings? My voice was fine. What did I say wrong on those recordings? I didn't even see the recording. All I know is I did nothing wrong. We had a lot of papers, a lot of papers stacked up. Mm -hmm. In fact, you could hear the rustle of the paper, and nobody said I did anything wrong other than the fake news, which, of course, is Fox, too. We had mostly fantastic people. I would say for every, and everybody has uh, bad ones. You have some that are good, but they turn out to be not so good. They're not courageous enough, like a Bill Barr. He had no courage. Uh, but you have, uh, for every one like that, I've had, I would say, at least 10 that were great. And we rebuilt the military. We got the largest tax cuts in the history of our country. We got the largest regulation cuts in history. We had the strongest border that anybody's ever had. We've never seen a border like that, and now it's a disaster with people coming in from jails and mental institutions pouring into our country. We had the strongest southern border ever. Uh, when you think about rebuilding the military and Space Force, we added Space Force first time in 78 years. Uh, since the Air Force, actually, it, it's become very important. Now, we had a, a great administration. We didn't have a disaster like Afghanistan, where they leave $85 billion behind a 13 dead soldiers. That should have never happened. American citizens left behind. Uh, I think it was the most embarrassing moment in history. Uh, if the election weren't rigged, and I'm, you won't put it on because you're Fox, but if the election weren't rigged, you wouldn't have had the Russia disaster, the horrible, horrible situation with Ukraine that would have never happened. Putin wouldn't have done it. And China would never be talking about Taiwan right now either, which could be the next one.